somebody on KC from Dock BC. Hey guys, are back at the French Creek Marina on Vancouver Island. We've got a really nice day here today. We have nice bright sunny skies. We're sitting at 14 degrees Celsius with just a little ripple on the water. I see there's a little bit of fog out there, but I think that's going to burn off pretty fast. So it's going to be a real nice day out there cruising on the water. Take a look at this nice big old luxury boat coming in here. This is one of those uh, Maritimo 48 footers. This is one nice looking boat. I wouldn't mind having this one sitting on my driveway. <laughs> well, let's take a look at the specs of this boat. Uh, the length is 51 feet 6 inches. The beam is 16 feet 9 inches, so that's a nice big old beamy boat. I can see Doc BC living on this one uh, full time. I tell you, there's a lot of square feet aboard this one. And I don't think Miss Doc BC would like living on this one full time, so maybe we can live on this one in the summertime. And then uh, in the wintertime, we can pull it out and put it on the driveway. But I think uh, I don't think that'll be allowed because the boat's too long. It probably wouldn't fit on the driveway. <laughs> Yeah, it's nice to dream, you know. You got to have pretty deep pockets to hold one of these big old luxury boats. Power on board are two 750 horsepower Cummins diesel engines. Fuel on board is 3,596 liters. So yeah, that's a pretty good whack of fuel. It's going to carry a long ways out there on the water. But yeah, we're sitting over two dollars a liter now, so yeah, we're going to be looking at over seven thousand dollars to fill this one up. But if you can afford the boat, you're going to be able to afford the gas, no problem. But uh, Doc BC won't be having a boat like this. His pockets aren't deep enough, eh? I think I'd be looking more like a, a 16-foot aluminum uh, center console boat uh, with uh, maybe a 25 or 30 horsepower engine in the back. And, yeah, to fill up the tank, it might cost 30, 40 bucks. So, yeah. But you know, you got a dream. Uh, well, you may win the lottery one day, and you might be able to afford a big boat like this, eh? <laughs> yeah, it's kind of crazy, eh? Fresh water on board is 378 liters, and the gray water tank is uh, 302 liters. So you got a lot of liquid space on this one to store it up before you have to come back into the marina to offload it. <laughs> This one has a full-size galley with a stove top, oven, microwave, fridge freezer combo, and a dishwasher. The Maritimo has two staterooms on board, he's with a nice double bed, and he also have two heads on board with a full-size shower, so you can stay nice and squeaky clean down there. Electronics on board, you got a GPS with a map plotter, and a depth sounder. A satellite radio and TV. This one has a really nice sound system on board. It's a Bose sound system, so it's going to be nice and loud and super clear. It has radar board. It has, even has a DVD player. So I don't know how many people have DVDs, but uh, if you have a DVD, you can click it in your DVD player. It's a Samsung one, so it's good stuff, eh? <laughs> Nowadays, people have Bluetooth coming right off their... Uh, cell phones so that's probably what this one has is probably bluetooth on bar too eh and this one also has autopilot so it's kind of nice if you're all floating there on the water you can kick it into autopilot and head on down and have some steak and prawns but it's a good idea to have somebody on watch even if you're an autopilot because you wouldn't want to pile into a side of a big freighter or something like that eh <laughs> yeah that would be kind of a disaster this one has a, a VHF radio. It probably has two VHF radios on board, so you need a backup in case one goes down. Also on board, you have a stern and bow thruster, so that's really handy to have for coming in and off the dock. Uh, this one has electric village pump. It has a hurricane hydronic heating system, so that sounds pretty fancy. So it sounds expensive too, but I tell you, it'll keep you all nice and toasty warm. This one even has a washer and dryer, but uh, you got your shore power inlet and uh, you know, even have a cockpit shower, right? In case you dive in the water and you want to rinse yourself off the, uh, all the salt off. You, know, you got a swim ladder on board too. Yeah, this is one nice big old boat and uh, if you got the bucks, you might as well spend it and enjoy it. Eh? Well, everybody, uh, thanks for coming along and having a look at the uh, Maritimo 48 footer. 
Have a great day. Yeah, hey you guys, uh, thanks for coming to Dog PC and watching my videos. I hope you come back and watch another one. Have a great day, everybody.